conference for our first quarter earnings. Today with us, we'll have Mr. Krishna Prasad, Managing Director of Granules India, Dr. Bhaskar Krishna, Chief Executive Officer, and Mr. Vivias Murthy, Chief Financial Officer of Granules. I'd like to welcome them to the stage, please. of Granules India. I'm Dr. Bhaskar Krishna. I'll be walking through the results. I have with me Mr. Krishna Prasad, who's the managing director and founder, and uh, Mr. Vivias Murthy, who's our uh, chief financial officer. Before I get into the actual results, before we get into the actual results, I would like to first talk a little bit about uh, granules and what are the key differentiators that granules has. Do I... Uh, A few things that uh, make granules stand apart are one of the key things is focus. If you look at granules as a company, we focus on a few products. We master them and strive to be the best at those products. Second, that is very much linked to focus is scale. With focus, we also build scale. I mean, we, in a pharmaceutical industry, we are the ones who look for economies of scale, things in terms of thousands of tons. And linked to focus and scale comes market leadership. And what we mean by that is we want to be in the top three suppliers, if not the top one. In many cases, we aspire to be the number one. But we want to be, for the products we are in, we want to be in the top three suppliers of those products. And for the customers and markets, we want to be those players, the top three players in that region or with the customer, very often with key customers, we're aspiring to be the number one supplier for that particular product. Fourth is we build our strength by collaborating with customers. That's been a very important aspect, a key element of our success. Working very closely with our key customers, trying to understand their pain points, and go beyond just supplying product, right? Go very much further than that, working very close with them, and the business transparency. This has resulted in customers uh, coming back to us, as you will see later. Uh, we, last year, in the last 12 months, we grew our business with 75% uh, of the customers. 72% of the customers, our sales grew year on year. In terms of looking at the company's growth, we have taken the model of partnerships. In 2007, we formed a joint venture with Biocos in China for ibuprofen. And that joint venture is still doing well and uh, growing and an important part of our portfolio. In addition to the Biocos, last year we announced that we are forming a joint venture with Omnichem, a Belgium-based company, it helped us accelerate entry into the cramp space. That joint venture, we have started uh, building the facility, and it's going very well. So growth through partnerships has been a key element for us. And then for our business model, efficiencies, cost efficiencies, having the best cost position is very important. So an important pillar of our success is operational excellence. We have a strong team with black belts. Uh, focused, dedicated teams that are looking constantly for ways to improve our processes, whether for yields to throughput, simplifying things, and so on. Okay. Now, all these things, all these differentiators have helped and taken us to a place where, if you look at our results for the last year, we grew 38%, right? From about uh, 256 crores, we are at six. We closed last year on a consolidated basis at 654 crores, posting a CAGR of 30 percent, which is significantly higher than the industry average. Uh, and and 38 percent shown there is for the year-on-year -year growth, due to a focus on efficiency. Uh, this is this uh, our profit for fiscal year 12 uh, that we closed uh, in March uh, grew was 30 crores which is an increase of 43% over the previous year. Our, our plants, as I've said earlier, have the global scale, and which means that we are the largest suppliers supplying to regulated markets for our products, the products like paracetamol, metformin, ibuprofen, and so on. 